please rise for the national anthem and the presentation of colors. Let us pray. Dear God, thank you for allowing all of us to gather here on this special night to celebrate graduation. Thank you for all the accomplishments, memories, and friendships and lessons learned over the last four years. Thank you for putting people in our lives such as parents, family members, teachers, and staff to help us where we are today. Most importantly, thank you for sending your son Jesus to die on the cross for our sins. Lord, I pray you will continue to guide us as we begin a new chapter in our lives. We love you, Father. In Jesus' name I pray, amen. You may be seated. Good evening and welcome. Family, friends, faculty, and staff, and of course, the class of 2023, Chigaffney High School's graduation ceremony. My name is Justin Wynn, and I'm most grateful to have been given the opportunity to speak as your salutatorian. To start, I'm proud of everyone in the class of 2023. We finally made it. All four years of high school finally led up to the significant moment in our lives. Even though our freshman year and sophomore year was disrupted by COVID, I can confidently say many great memories were still made with what time we had together. As I was preparing this speech, I wonder what we all had in common as we approached the end of our high school years. After contemplating and staring blankly at the ceiling, I could not think of anything. That was until I was reminded of a personal goal that I set for myself in Dr. Shell's calculus class, which is by far the most challenging class I've taken, but definitely one of the most memorable. Anyways, I was given the task of picking a word that I would attempt to pursue throughout this year. That word was resilience. I interpreted the word as the ability to adjust 
recover readily from any upcoming adversities or difficulties. Unknowingly, most of us had already had our resilience tested throughout high school as well. Those countless nights of staying up to study or hours of practice before an upcoming game, everybody has had their fair share of struggles. But this is only the start. After high school, everyone will go down their own dreams and desires. Some may go to college to pursue their career. Others may participate in athletics to, per to play professionally one day. Whatever it may be, there will be hurdles along the way. The toughest part is staying resilient and true to your passion. Although you may not have realized it, everyone graduating here today can do so. I mean, we've been able to for four years already. Of course, we will not have, been ma we will not have made it without the support of everyone here today. From friends and family, to coaches and teachers, and those that are present or watching. I want to take this time to say a sincere thank you to everyone that contributed to our time and experience. We appreciate all you have provided and your patience in caring for us, even if it is the little things. From teachers, as Mr. Hardy, who would always greet everyone with a smile on his face, Ms. Gautam, caring for each student, regardless of how frustrating it may be, and Ms. Fall, who would always put up with our troubles. They all have made substantial impacts on my high school experience. And of course, I cannot forget my friends that I get to laugh with at lunch, teammates to, make, to share memories with, and classmates to sympathize with when we're about to take a calc test. Most importantly, I'll specifically thank my parents that have done everything to help me succeed. That have shown and instilled in me the importance of hard work. Growing up, I was stubborn and inconsiderate of how much time and effort my parents put into making my life better. And now that I am transitioning into a new part of my life and seeing a small portion of adulthood, I am more aware of the struggles my parents have gone through to provide for me. All they had asked of me to do was try and do better for me and for them. In the end, all it takes is a little bit of effort. It may not be much at first, but you will succeed if you just try, even if it is only a little bit. As I conclude my speech, I'll let you again I will again like to congratulate class of 2023. So as each of us part our ways, remember, resilience is key to further pursue our aspirations. And as Drake said, we'll see what's about to happen next. Thank you. Was it only yesterday? It seems as if it was just yesterday that we sprouted from the ground, willing and eager to shine amongst those around us. It feels just like yesterday when we ask those wiser to guide us on our journey. Maybe drifting against the wind doesn't always mean we are alone. Was it only yesterday that the metamorphosis from child to adult was complete, blossoming into a new sense of self-being. Now, as we are today, we've reached the end of our course through adolescence, leaving behind the comfort of our cocoon and entering life completely changed from how we once entered it. Well, it's crazy to believe that it was actually four years ago when we walked into the ninth grade cafeteria that first day for orientation. And as I'm sure most of us were feeling a little out of place, I must have appeared especially lost because Smitty came up to me and said, I don't think you're in Kansas anymore. To which I responded, well, if I click my heels three times, can I go back? Now I'm standing here before you all at our high school graduation wondering that same thing. As these last four years have flown by, I'm sure most of us are feeling that same way again. Yet because of the people sitting in these stands today, each of us made it here. And for me, that would not have been possible without my loving family and some of the teachers that I was fortunate enough to have. They have taught me many life lessons, from Miss Wallace always supporting me, 
Miss Fall, willing to listen anytime. Miss Aveta, happy to help whenever she's needed. Miss Ray, always being there. Coach Gregory, caring so much about his students who live to get sidetracked, engaged in a year-long AP class. And Coach Holmes, who showed us honesty to prepare us for real life. But most of all, to my family, to my grandparents who have shown me how to make the best of each life's opportunities, and especially to my mom and dad who have given me more love than one person deserves and have placed the world at my fingertips even when I am not always as grateful as I should be. They have taught me to always get back up even after I take a wrong turn and to just do my best because that's the best that I can do. If it had not been for those people and the many friends I made along the way, high school would have been nothing more than a place that we were required to come to every day. During our time here, we were presented with many opportunities to achieve our athletic, artistic, and academic goals. Even though I believe that schoolwork and grades are important, we only have so much time together. And some of us may never see each other again. So it is worth devoting more quality time to with one another rather than always working. Sometimes you just have to live in the moment and enjoy it because they go by in a blink. Sure, the awards, medals, and titles look nice on paper and are what people work towards. At the end of the day, they get put on a shelf and are forgotten about. Truthfully, the accomplishments that each of us may hold, somebody else has held in the past and another will in the future. Not to downplay the tremendous significance that awards may hold, but coming from someone who has won an award or two, the accomplishment itself is not what you will remember, but it's the path you took to get there. And in my experience, it's the people that travel that road with you that truly make the difference. It's having that person to stand up for you in the ninth grade cafeteria. Someone who will pause the movie every time you have a question. Someone to learn how to waltz with you. Somebody to text about politics with. Someone to eat with before every soccer game. And even somebody to sit in the middle of the field with you to write this speech. These people are who made the memories worth having because without the relationships, then the memories may have just been tasks to accomplish rather than good times to have had. Without that person who will let you come to their office to eat candy and solve life's problems, a group to ride down the beach with, the top off the Jeep, the group to help you survive this hardest class ever and play basketball with, and a best friend to take to college with you. Each of these activities without these people would simply not have been the same. For me, being a part of both the cross country and soccer teams were wonderful experiences in themselves. They most importantly introduced me to some of my lifelong friends. And while each of these memories are one specific to my own life, I know that each of us here have our own as well and people that we shared them with, which made each high school journey un unique. Yet of all the relationships in life, there is one that is more important than, you will, than any other you will ever make. And that is your personal relationship with Jesus Christ. For those of you who truly know him, you can testify with me that your relationship with him is the most important one in your life. And for those of you who do not have that relationship, I'm here to tell you that Jesus will be the best friend you'll ever have. He loved you so much that he came to this world died on a cross for your sins, and rose again so that you could live forever with him. And if that's not a relationship worth having, then I don't know what is. As Jeremiah 9, 23 through 24 says, Don't let the wise boast in their wisdom, or the powerful boast in their power, or the rich boast in their riches. But those who wish to boast should boast in this alone, that they truly know me and understand that I am the Lord. I could stand here and boast about some of the things I have accomplished over the past four years, but as I've said, those are not what truly matter. It's the relationships I have built along the way that have gotten me where I am today, and especially my relationship with Jesus Christ. So take my advice, or don't. I really do not know all that much, but for some reason I was asked to give this speech today. So I guess somebody must have had some confidence in what I had to say. Thank you to all of those who I am fortunate enough to call my friends and make memories with, and to each of you sitting here today, because these last four years at Gaffney High School have truly been amazing. 
Don't get so caught up in the task each day holds. Just go out in the world and do your best. Create those relationships. And remember, it's not the end goals that make your life. It's the journey that, took, that you took to get there. Thank you. To the graduating class of 2023, first I'd like to say thank you and congratulations. To Emma Paris and Justin Wynn, I don't think anyone can appreciate what it takes to become valedictorian or salutatorian of a high school the size of Gaffney. The countless hours of studying, working with teachers, and the sacrifices you have to make to reach the outcomes in which you desire. I am certain as both of you move on to Clemson University, you will do Gaffney High School proud. To Sean Ponder, thank you for sharing your heart with all of us tonight with your senior class poem. To all of you, please know that taking risk will separate you from being average as you move throughout your life. You have all overcome many obstacles and had multiple accomplishments in academics, athletics, and the arts during your time here at Gaffney High. One of the obstacles you faced in your freshman year was the closure of school during COVID. You, the school staff, and the community had to learn inventive ways to overcome learning from home. Your sophomore year began with coming to school on specific days to a limited number of students in the school. Many of you had, the, had to overcome challenges in your personal life as well that you are far too, that, are, that to you, excuse me, are far too greater than COVID and you still persevere. There have been many accomplishments that have been made here at Gaffney High School, whether as a group of students or as individuals for the class of 2023. This class received a total of $14,676,527 in scholarships towards their post-secondary education. This includes 14 Palmetto Fellow Scholars, 274 Life Scholarships, and one South Carolina Teaching Fellow. Great job. You have been a part of the Band of Gold, Drama, and Chorus competitions where you have won numerous awards. You have performed in many events of the, in the community and other schools. You have been a part of Air Force Junior ROTC program that once again received the Distinguished Unit Award. You have given back to your community in events such as Penny Wars, which all proceeds went to the Cherokee Children's Home. You have been a part of the community coat drive that provided needy people the ability to stay warm in the winter. You have competed as individuals or as teams in athletic and academic competitions and won championships and received accolades for those endeavors. This is the first year of graduates in the Scholars Academy. We also have two students who went through the early college program and are leaving our district with an Associate of Science degrees from Spartanburg Community College. <clears throat> as we send our students out of the corridors of Gaffney High School, we'll be sending students to colleges as close as Limestone University and Spartanburg Community College, yet as far away as the University of Oklahoma. Some students will enter the workforce and others will have received at the higher calling of defending our nation in the military. We look forward for this, towards the success that you will bring to our school and our community. The tradition of being a Gaffney Indian should not be one that you take lightly. You witnessed this firsthand at homecoming this past fall. I hope you leave here with a sense of pride that those of us who graduated here did. Gaffney is different and we own that with pride and tradition. I have talked with you about honors and accomplishments and being successful, but I would be remiss if I didn't tell you what the greatest success can be, to have love in your heart and respect for one another. You see, coming to Gaffney High here, this is my first year of principal and being here, I ask your teachers to focus on loving you. Truthfully, sometimes that can be harder than others, but I hope that I, that we, have demonstrated that. What we and all the people here witness, witnessing this graduation know 
that you are the key to the future of this community, this state, and this nation. So I finished talking with you now. So as I finished talking with you now this evening, although I want you to be the greatest you can be, the ultimate satisfaction for me and your families is, is that you are happy, healthy, and that you know that you are loved. To everyone in the stands, we are here tonight to celebrate all of our graduates. I know the joy that you are feeling tonight, and we all want to share this together. Before I said that Gaffney is different. Let's show everyone that tonight. Could you imagine being the student or the family of a student who did not hear their child's name called because someone in the crowd felt that they were bigger than the celebration of those students who also worked just as hard to get here? We ask that each of you hold your applause until the end. Thank you so much. Once again, to our seniors, congratulations. At this time, will the class of 2023 please stand for the presentation of the diplomas. Emma Grace Paris, valedictorian, honor graduate. Justin C. Lay Wynn, salutatorian, honor graduate. Jordan Joseph Mathis, student body president, honor graduate. Taja Stevon Lattimore, senior class president. Sean William Ponder. Alana Lucinda McClooney. Turner Harris Owens, honor graduate. Colby Sanders Turner. Jonathan O'Neill Lopez. Megan Grace Abernathy Coyle, Chasmine Alexiana Adams, Nestor Enrique Alice, Gabriel Evan Allison, Jessup Stokes Allison, Armando Alvarez, Tamia Gabrielle Ames, Victoria Elizabeth Annas, Johan Yabani Argon Pacas, Nairo Mosaic Archa, Angel Lauren Michelle Archer, Caleb Zion Archie, Eduardo Ariano, Aaron Ismael Arroyo, Brandon Avila, Diana Karina Avila, Caitlin Alina Baldwin, Alberto Jesus Ballesteros Sprouse II, Indiria Dion Barnes, Emily Keegan Barnhill, Ariana Latasia Bates, Ashanti Nale Bates, Molly Ann Bahiler, honor graduate, Riley Grace Bell, Tamaya Najade Benson, Justice Kane Bevis, Jamiracal Indiasia Denise Bigger, Peyton Craig Bingham, Bailey Parker Black, Hannah Morgan Blackwell, Keegan Madison Blackwell, Taylor McKenzie Blackwell, Gavin Samuel Blanton, Kaylee Michelle Blanton, honor graduate, Jason Edward Bohm, Arthur Jordan Bolin, Dante William Bond, Tamari Amina Bonner, Noah Falls Bradley, Tamaria Lachey Brennan, Bo Walker Bratton, Abigail Rose Bridges, Zachary Keon Bridges, Samara Alexandra Bronner, Adasia Nakayla Brown. Edward Germain Buxton, Brent Timothy Robert Burnett, Justin Dwayne Byers, Jonathan Ivan Calderilla, Amaya Cheyenne Calderon Velasquez, James Jordan Hunter Camp, William Sherrod Camp, Michael Jerome Campbell, Adriana Nicole Carver, Brandon Michael Casper, Emily Catherine Kaufman, Ricardo Celio Villanueva, Takaya Najare Chavis, 
Caroline Isabella Catherine Childers, honor graduate. Jaliza Nicole Clyburn. Natalie Faith Cochran. Jacob Aiden Coffey. Coral Aned Colon Rodriguez. Jacob Aiden Connick. Ansley Grace Cook. Paris Jane Cook. Ajira Tajane Cook Brooks. Jacob Thomas Council. Aiden J. Crocker. Sakaya Jane Crosby. Emily Grace Crow. Olivia Leanne Crow. Dontrell Jabari Cumberlander Tate. Avery Brooke Daniels. Grace Elizabeth Davis. Madison Naomi Davis. Princess Lynette Valshonda Davis. Akira Kalela Dawkins. Amare Krishan Dawkins. Jamiria Lanasia Dawkins. Kamari Nicole Dawkins. Arissa Elena De La Cerda. Skylin J. Dijon. Isabella Marie Del Cid. Logan Kathleen Denton. Raekwon Malachi Dowdle. Keith Terrell Drake Jr. Bryce Samuel Edwards. Tristan Scott Elliott. Kobe Wayne Epley. Christopher Ramos Estrada. Daniel Jose Estrada. Yazir Estrado, honor graduate. Tyann Gerard Calvin Flores. Iman Cheandre Fana. Sarah Catherine Fowler. Wesley Blake Fuller. Tamarje Zaquan Futrell. Abraham Garcia. Mallory Lauren Garcia, honor graduate. Naomi Garcia. Annalie Danielle Gibson. Ronan Michael Gibson. Jamie Lee Good. Hunter Daniel Goodson. Joshua Paul Gordon. Jeremiah Franklin Green. Elijah Ray Griffin. Casey Adamari Grijalva. Alan Drake Gunnels. William Michael Guthrie. Cameron Michael Haddon. Alexia Ree Hall. David Hunter Hall. Joseph David Lane Hammett. Jahari Zaki Hardy. Megan Marie Harriman. Jada Kaylin Harris. Caden Raylan Harris. Ryan Tandarius Harris. Trevin Jace Harris. Jonathan Paul Harvey. Sherman Duran Hayes. Seth Dean Hefner. Gregory Shane Helveston. Jalea Larie Henry. Alicia Marie Henson. Juan Diego Hernandez. Anna Lane Hill. Austin Lee Hill. Caitlin McKenzie Hines, honor graduate. Jameson Riley Hodges. Caliber Daylin Huey. Landon Davis Holcomb. Cameron Daylin Leonte Hopper. Matthew Douglas Horkler, honor graduate. Carson Sierra Umphreys. Trinity Zaria Hunt. Seth Andrew Inman. Jazaria Isaiah Jackson. Tariana Kean Jamison. Ezekiel Lawrence Lewis Jeffries. Jalen Kanye Jeffries. Elijah Kamaya Jeffries Hill. Eli John Jarazal. Jaden McKenzie Johnson. Nathan Keyshawn Johnson. Stephen Caleb Jolly. Ashlyn Blake Jones. Noah Daniel Jones. Joseph Jamal Jordan. Jamarion Tyrone Kirby. Jalen Grace Knapp, honor graduate. Alan Michael Lail. Alex Curtis Lamb. Joshua Caleb Lance. 
Alejandro Lara Gutierrez, Emily Grace Largent, honor graduate, Keenan Scott Lavender, Michael Aaron Lawless, Imani Lily Rose Leach, Sixthly Leal Espinoza, Ariagnes de la Caridad Lado Blot, Anthony James Lee, Gage Edward Lee, Katie Allison Rose Grace Lee, Cole Michael Lamaster, Cameron Jade Lewis, Stephen Allen Lingerfelt Jr., Mariah Nicole Little, Avalon Jariah Little John, Brayshawn Alexander Little John, Victoria Elizabeth Loisiga, Zachary Keith Loisiga, Grayson Reese Loftus, Aiden Thomas Logan, Elise Lyric Logan, Olivia Desiree Long, Kirsten Nicole Laddie, Carlos Alberto Madrid, Jashe Naye Minning, Alan Gabriel Mariquin, Nadia Carolina Mariquin, Ashton Blaine Martin, Delaney Grace Martin, Kikiana Deshante Danielle Martin, Rosemarie Ann Martin, Emily Marie Martinez, Amalia Kathleen Mata, Andrew Elliot Mathis, Angel Patricia Bailey Matthews, Christian Mackay Mayfield, Samantha Gail McCall, Justin Andrew McClooney, Layla Janae McClooney, John David McCurry, Annalise Claire McGoldrick, Ian Matthias McIntyre, Janae Schuyler McKinley, Shayla Elizabeth Medley, honor graduate, Madison Leanne Millen, Liana Delaney Miller, Dantravian Jaquez Mills, Darren James Millwood, Ramsey Faith Millwood, Alexis Michelle Moore, Stephen Anthony Moore, Karimi Giselle Moreno, Derasia Ladina Morgan, Ansley Grayson Morris, Riley Seth Morris, Brianna Ellen Mullinax, Bryson Scott Mullinax, Chad Everett Murray, Chase Lee Murray, Miles Hampton Norris, Jacob Daniel Norwood, Jacqueline Ortega, Esley Elizabeth Ortiz Velasquez, Hannah Faith Owens, Leah Kelly Page, Anna Christina Paniagua, Kendall Morgan Parker, Kinsley Logan Parker, Madeline Thayer Parker, Matthew Jacob Parker, Ryan Edwin Parker Jr., Grayson Neal Parks, Angela Yadira Pastrana, Aditya Shirag Patel, Heer Bhavin Patel, Manav Sanjay Kumar Patel, Vidi Ashish Patel, honor graduate, Savannah Abigail Patterson, Kimberly Paz Rodriguez, Lanaya Burnett Peebles, Augustine Penaloza Barajas, Angel Penaloza Hernandez, Alondra Marie Perez Cortez, Jordan Maria Elise Peterson, Tabitha Cheyenne Peterson, Claudia Lynn Pettit, Diera Liaja Petty, Samuel Atticus Philbeck, Aaliyah Marie Phillips, Mysterious Quavion Phillips, Olin Patrick Phillips II, Trinity Sunshine Phillips, Brett Michael Poole, Caden Nathaniel Pugh, Layla Delane Porsche, Megan Lee Price, Olivia Christine Price, Hannah Kamaya Nicole Proctor, Tasha Janae Proctor, Alasia Nicole Quinn, Alejandro Ramirez, Jacqueline Ramirez, Mayron Paola Ramirez, Austin Michael Rash, Sage Raleigh, Cecilia Razo, 
Jennifer Nicole Razzo, Susanna Razzo with Drago, Colby James Ray, Kaylee Ann Reed, Alyssa Renee Reynolds, Ariel Tamlin Reinhardt, Kayla Gabrielle Reed Rice, Noah Kayla Brittlesberger, Ethan Pierce Robbins, Zoe Sanaya Shanice Robbs, Yadiel Rodriguez Morales, Christian Danilo Rodriguez, Lyric Trista Alfreda Rogers, Skyla Lene Rogers, Kaylee Rasil Ruiz, Ryder Lynn Roop, Elizabeth Jasa Delaney Roop Fowler, Sereno Daniel Saldana, Ashton Delone Samuel, Josefina Sanchez, Johnny Lee Surratt the third, Stephen Tyrone Surratt the second, Adam Eugene Scruggs, Desmond Malik Scruggs, Joshua Landon Scruggs, Ethan Nicholas Siegel, Eli Jett Sellers, Emma Lawton Sellers, Brandon Luke Shiflett, honor graduate, Jayana Maitrell Shippey, Seth Bradley Simmons, Jacob Thomas Simpson, Kianze Makai Tashun Sims, Yeshua Jazir Sims, Ethan Mark Sizemore, Amari Asia Shanaja Smith, Barrington Leon Smith Jr., Devontae Tyrell Smith, Diabron Kaylee Smith, Demario Shanti Smith, Faith Tani Smith, Hallie Rebecca Smith, Jaden Colt Smith, Honor Graduate, Jemiah Naye Smith, Joseph Ernest Smith Jr., Sydney Madison Smith, Trey Micah Smith, Turner Addison Smith, Honor Graduate, Alexand Devin Alexandre Sotelo Trejo, Madison Diane Sperber, True Justine Stephan, Skylin Silk Strain, Alize Francis Sullivan, Tyshawn Malik Surratt, Danielle Janetta Tate, Lily Madeline Tate, Samad Josiah Tate, Treshawn Tremantin Tate, Emma Gonchia Tao, Seth Ginu Tao, Badrez Dervell Antoine Thomas, Dustin Joe Thomas, Rylan Page Thornton, Nicholas Alexander Trejo, Anna Grace Turner, Regan Kimberly Vanderpool, Keila Sherlyn Vargas Alvarez, Michael Velez Jr. Aaliyah Demaya Watts, Grayson Neal Wells, Danica Nicole Werner, Dakota Faith Westbrooks, Jason Lucas Welchel, Kamaya Dakiria Whitaker, Dakota Hayden White, Lacey Cheyenne White, Janaya Iman Wilhite, Kirsten McKenzie Wilkie, Roy Tavius Abel Wilkie, Faith Gabrielle Wilkins, Frontieria Elasia Williams, Jordan Dakota Williams, Zaria Simone Williams, Alyssa Yvonne Wilson, Cameron Douglas Wilson, Jackson Scott Winkler, Emma Grace Womack, Honor Graduate, Carson Corey Womack, Honor Graduate, Cadence Deanne Wright, Riley Elizabeth Wright, Rebecca Alohanani Wyatt, Timberly Faye Wyatt, Garrett James Young, Vicki Zhang, and Andrew Bailey Ziegelhafer.
At this time, will the class of 2023 please stand for the presentation? Never mind. I present to you the class of 2023. You may move your tassels from the right to the left. All right, seniors. Seniors, will you please return to your seat for the benediction and alma mater. Seniors, give us just a couple minutes. Seniors. All right, one last time. Let's have a seat. Seniors, have a seat. Just five more minutes at the most. Hang tight. Let us pray. Dear Heavenly Father, we come today to tell you thank you. Thank you for each and every graduate of the class of 2023. We thank you for each parent, coach, teacher, and who have taught them and challenged them along the way. Lord, we pray that you send your grace and mercy upon each graduate here today as they start a new chapter of life. We pray that you open doors of opportunity and let them know that we may endure for a night, but joy comes in the morning. God just said in your word, with man this is impossible, but with God all things are possible. God, let them know that when they put your name in any situation, it starts to get better. God, as these graduates travel the dangerous roads of life, we ask that you protect them like only or now. In Jesus' name we ask, amen. All right, if you will please stand for the playing of the Gaffney High School alma mater. All right, so thank, thank you everyone for attending tonight. Uh, we'll begin our processional now and we, your students will meet you out front. Thank you very much.